Hey everyone, sorry I'm later than normal on a Wednesday with my Wednesday live um, but we've been to the circus tonight it was Cirque du Chalet um, a cheaper version of Cirque du Soleil I think um, but it was really good fun here in Wakefield, West Yorkshire um, lots of acrobatics and gymnastics and I managed to take three kids on my own um, as you might be able to hear my voice is going after so much screaming at the football last night watching England Hola, watching England play Colombia but anyhow for this Wednesday live as I found out this morning I was on TV on BBC 2 I believe oh no BBC 1 sorry I've just checked the site um, with Denise Lewis she came over to my house to help me clean it now you're probably wondering why as much as my house does need a clean but why would an Olympic champion want to come to my dirty house to help me clean um, well it was part of a TV show called right on the money and they wanted um, a Yorkshire based family blogger um, which is myself um, to try out some cleaning products to test whether I could tell the difference between shop-bought shop -bought cleaning products and homemade ones so the homemade ones were cheaper and better for the environment and um, but it was a blind test so I didn't know which one was which so I thought I'd show you as I've not watched it yet I've just got home from the circus um, bizarrely it reminded me I used to work at a circus <laughs> random fact about me um, and I was also on Radio Leeds this afternoon BBC talking about a booper campaign I'm involved in um, but as ever with a croaky voice um, I blame England and all the stress um, but it was such a good match in the end anyway so yeah so I thought I'd show you Denise Lewis at my house so see if you can see it all right and I've also got this I'm on my old phone because my Google Pixel's been fake so sorry if it's a bit blurry and um, but I've got this really cool handheld thing now a Joby it's really cool I definitely recommend it it's nice and solid a lot more solid than a selfie stick and I can bend it all sorts of ways but anyway I'll without further ado oh and I've just got a question what did you do at the circus um, well, as much as I've always wanted to be a contortionist, and I do love a back bend, um, I was actually working as an agent for circus acts, um, and then also learning hoop and silks um, and everything else. I do belong in a circus, really, um, but I had kids, and then it all changed. So anyway, here's the right on the money malarkey. See if you can have a laugh at me on TV. So yeah, this is BBC One. And this is, oh, by the way, my new sexy laptop. My new Mac. <coughs> so there's old lovely Denise. She was so lovely, even though Ariana was playing up and would not let go of me. So let's see. Series four, episode three. There you can see me and Ari. And I don't know why I didn't brush my hair. Typical me being, oh, let me see. There we are. The patio doors are covered in Ariana's yogurty fingerprints. How will my homemade products fare in our unscientific home test? So we've got two types of products here for you. One is a multi-surface cleaner and one is a window cleaner, one shop bought and one that I've rustled up and made. First up, it's my multi-surface cleaner against the remains of Ariana's lunch. And they're off, starting with multi-surface cleaner A. So what do you think so far? Yeah, it seems decent, this one. Shall we try B now, Ari? See how it compares? <laughs> Quite watery, this one, isn't Not it? Cute. It doesn't spread as well as that other one, but it like leaves a bit of a gummy layer. Whereas this side, it's dried really nicely. So which do you think has performed better? I think overall, I'd say A. Bottle A? Yeah. 
but I'm not going to do the big reveal yet because we've still got one more product to test. This time, it's those yogurty windows. See, Ari, you've been spreading your magic over there again, so we're going to have to get your mum to clean it with these window cleaners. One shop bought and one is homemade. Here you go. Over to you. you. And off they go again. First up, bottle A. It's got the yoghurt off, but it has smeared quite a bit. Well, that looks pretty good. So now on to product B. Away you go. Great. Oh, let's wipe all this yoghurt off. That smells a lot nicer. And how's it cleaning so far? A lot better, I'd say. I think this is definitely a better one. I like the address. BMB. BMB. The window's clean, the table scrubbed. Sophie chose cleaner A for the table and B for the window. But were they shop bought or made by my own fair hands? Right, Sophie, the moment of truth. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Product A was. It's a victory for homemade. The homemade one. Let's do the second one. I'm really interested in this. So you chose product B for the windows, and that one was... You're not going to believe it. Great! Hey, oh, that's really good. I really didn't expect that with the window one. I'll be honest, I didn't think it was homemade either, because it was so good over there. It really worked so well. Wow. The results may be in, but the big question, how much would Sophie save if she made her own? So your multi-surface cleaning comes up at 32 pence to make up. So not only are you getting really good cleaning results, you're saving money too. And I mean. Exactly. <laughs> ah, there we have it. There I am with old Denise. Nice bit of cringe there. <laughs> but yeah, no, it's true. Vinegar is cheaper. Um, and apart from a slight vinegary smell, um, I actually do recommend the homemade ones. I have been using, I've found that I have good hybrid um, ones um, from a woman I know who does love to grow. So she makes your own homemade solutions, um, which is a good hybrid for me because I'm not sure if I'd ever actually get around to it. Um, but if you do make your own, it's a lot cheaper. Um, <clears throat> my voice is really hurting me but I like the sound of it nice and croaky um, but that's because well I also hurt my feet watching the football I was so excited at home on my own with the kids and um, they weren't bothered but I was um, so I really hurt my voice and my feet anyway I'll leave it out there that today I thought I'd give you a little sneak preview and also my first time viewing me and Denise on TV cleaning. Um, it was lots of good fun apart from Ariana not letting me put her down so it was a one-handed cleaning job and um, so luckily Denise was very very lovely and patient with Ariana um, who wouldn't leave my side. <laughs> anyway let me know what you use to clean what if and if you enjoy cleaning and whether you've used any homemade products just comment below. Anyway, I'm going to go and rest my voice and go to bed. Now night everyone, take care and I'll chat to you on Friday. Bye.